And before we get to those stories, we're going to head out to Katie to check in on Creech Elementary. Five years ago, Hurricane Harvey flooded the school and surrounding homes, displacing more than 800 students. Listen to this. Now the kindergartners from that year are in fifth grade, and we're checking in to see how they're doing today. And Abby, you know a little bit about two of the guys in this story. That's right. My dad teamed up with fellow meteorologist Justin Stapleton to see how weather has impacted the lives of these students. Enrique Ramirez has the story. It's a happy day here at Creech Elementary. School time. The meteorologists are here and everyone's excited. For Anthony and Justin, this isn't just a typical school visit. Weather has made a unique impact on this school and community, especially the fifth graders. Five years ago, they were just kindergartners. But just one week into their exciting start to elementary school. Harvey. We got in this big military truck to drive us out. We were on a boat and we were, my dad and my brother were just carrying the dogs over their shoulder and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so scared right now. The storm flooded their homes. We like had to like drive through it and the car was jumping. And then we sat on a rock at the, at the front of our neighborhood and we waited. A lifeboat came and picked, up, picked us up. And destroyed their school. I was scared for my teachers, mostly. I didn't know if they were in the school or not. And it felt like I wasn't going to have school again. The school and community rallied, though, rebuilding the school to reopen the next year. Now Justin and Anthony are here to see the progress these kids have made and answer their questions about extreme weather. And they have a lot of them. How do you know what category a hurricane is? What did you guys do during Hurricane Harvey? How do you get the weather accurate? If there's a storm, how do you track down the storm? What inspired you to be a meteorologist? They're in luck. These two have the answers. Jacob, you are the first contestant on Stump, the meteorologists. Just kidding. Not really. Which question? Can severe weather happen in space? From the science behind the storms. Weather has to have certain conditions to actually turn into severe. To why weather is important. A lot of what our job is to do is not just to talk about all of this stuff here, right? Is to tell you why it's important to you. And to communicate things that are very dangerous, that can be dangerous, like Harvey. In the United States, we get more severe weather than other countries around the world. And also, in the United States, that severe weather is actually not always a bad thing for us. And of course, understanding Harvey. Why do hurricanes spin? Why is there an eye? And it has something to do with something you probably played as a kid, tetherball. They start spinning crazy fast, and that's called the conservation of angular momentum. And that's what makes a hurricane strong. Where did all the water go after Harvey? And that's a great question. What you witnessed with Harvey was an extreme example of the water cycle. So what's next for these kids whose young lives have been so impacted by the weather? So what do you want to be when you grow up? A uh, meteorologist. So you want to be a broadcast meteorologist. Awesome. Well, that's great. Well, good luck. anything you need, you need any help, let me know. My dad, meteorologist Anthony Honest, can visit your school too. Here's the link on the main page at HoustonLife.tv.